Red Bull is very much a non-conformist team. We'll push the boundaries and that is part of the DNA of who we are. I think Formula One still has a prestige and a following the noise, the sound, the smell, the energy of these cars. It's modern day chariot racing. It's insane when you see the speeds of these cars and human beings are capable of controlling. That is the lure, that is the, the appeal of Formula One. Within our team, we're close to 900 people, and that is to design and produce two Grand Prix cars for 21 races in the year. Working in Formula One, it's not just a normal job because you're competing, you're in a competition. That makes the people our biggest asset. Dieter and Red Bull Racing share very similar brand values, very similar aspirations. It's cutting edge, it's not afraid to be different. Our drivers love wearing the product, the team love wearing the product. Formula One cars are extreme. We're fighting with regulations continually and the regulations dictate the shape of the car. We're great believers here that if it looks right, it tends to go all right on the circuit as well. The car is made up of about six and a half thousand components. It's not unusual that even at one race with a major update, you could be introducing up to a thousand new components. The cars are all handmade. It's a skill set that is still quite rare, but one that is unique to Formula One. Every circuit that we go to has a different layout, has a different configuration, has different types of corners. We'll go from the streets of Singapore and Monaco to the high-speed straights in Monza. And so every track we go to, we have to have a bespoke solution. We're studying all other aspects of a Grand Prix weekend, whether it's from satellites looking at the weather to competitor analysis, where there's so much technology that surrounds Formula One, it's just evolving constantly best result that you can possibly achieve as a team, which ultimately is winning a Grand Prix. That for me is the most tranquil part of a Grand Prix weekend is actually when the red light goes out. When you can put your blinkers on, you're in your own zone, fully focused on the hour and 45 minutes ahead of you. You have to be competitive to be in this business. It's a, a demanding job. It's a lot of travel. It's a lot of time away from home and family. But uh, nothing gives me greater satisfaction than seeing this team, this group, taking on the best in the world and, and coming out on top. <laughs>